Okay, TikTok has done it again. There's another viral recipe going around for ranch seasoned pickles and I want to try it. So I hurry up and placed a grocery order. I am picking it up now and I'm gonna go home and make it and show you guys how to make it. Um, it's real easy to do and it's like a delicious snack. So stay tuned. Hey there, Allison with EverydayShortcuts.com. Welcome back to my channel. So I have made it back from the store and got my ingredients to make this TikTok viral ranch seasoned pickles. And I know what you're thinking, like ranch and pickles, it just does not sound good, but don't knock it until you try it. And that's what we're gonna do today. So I have picked up the kosher dill spears and you basically want a pickle that is sliced so that way the um, seasoning can get onto the pickle itself. Um, if you don't have that, you can also use the hamburger dill chips or even, I think they make like sandwich slices um, in the pickles, but any kind of dill sliced pickle will work for this recipe and then you just need a packet of ranch seasoning mix and you can use either store brand or hidden valley brand um, or even if you want to make your own you can do that as well okay let's get started in making this recipe okay so here we go this is how we're going to make our ranch seasoned pickles are you ready for it it's super easy. You just take the ranch packet and you pour it in there. Just make sure that you get it all in there. Okay, and then you just kind of want to shake it in there and Make sure that you get it all in there and then you want to go ahead and put the lid on top and we're going to shake it. Okay, once you have shaken it so it's evenly coated, you will see that the color has changed and that the ranch seasoning is all in there. And it will be nice and even throughout the pickle spears. And then what you wanna do is just put it in the refrigerator overnight. The longer you marinate it, the better taste it's gonna be. And then when you're done, you can just store the remaining leftovers you can keep them either in this pickle jar um, or you can use like a wide mouth mason jar and just keep them in the fridge until they're all gone and when you want more just make some more okay i'm also going to do um, the other kind of pickles i'm going to use the hamburger dill chips they're the oval cuts and they look like this this is good for like sandwiches or you can put them like chop them up and put them in dips or even on hot dogs or just eat it alone but I'm gonna put them in this jar here and then we're going to seal them and put the dressing in here so let's do this one we're just going to dump everything in there 
get that all in there and then we are going to add our seasoning packet. Okay, so then you want to add your ranch seasoning packet in there, making sure that you get it all in there. And then we are going to shake that up. Okay, once you have it all shaken up, you want to go ahead and seal it and put it in the fridge overnight and then enjoy it on sandwiches or alone. Um, and yeah, there you go. Enjoy. Okay, so if you don't have a large wide mouth mason jar, I actually found an alternative. So if you happen to have this Smucker's Natural Peanut Butter Creamy, it's the 26 ounce. You can just take this jar. I just soaked it off with some hot water, dish soap, and vinegar. Soaked the label off, and it is the perfect size for the pickles. As you can see, it's pretty close to like the same size, but they'll fit in here and nicely. And then it comes with a nice gold lid and then you can put that on top and you can store the remaining leftovers in there if you want if you want to make them look kind of fancy or you could just keep them into the pickle jar that's it that is my tip for you enjoy